Hey guys, Silent Seo here. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. If you guys are playing Utame Cross, you know, um, since last night, ever since the server refresh, you probably noticed a brand new mission banner up here. And it's mainly because today, the 9th of April 2022, is day one of the brand new Valkyrie Live Concert, Valkyrie Reborn. So, yes, Japanese fans are technically at the event. Right now, uh, Makuhare Mese and um, busy exchanging and purchasing whatever blind packages, you know, gachas and all that uh, within themselves. Sadly, the international fans, we are left out of it. <laughs> what are you guys doing, international macros? You know, ever since Harmony Go and Big West shook hands and agreed to, um, you know, kind of spread the, the culture around the world. It seems like ever since the Macross Plus movie promotion in America, uh, it seems only America got the love. <laughs> Where's the rest of the world? <laughs> um, yeah, ever since then, Macross has still been locked behind international walls. Uh, within Japan itself only and where is the live stream globally for this brand new Macross Delta or the Valkyrie live concert? We had one in the last live concert, where is the one for this time round? This, this just makes no sense. Anyways, uh, enough of that. Um, during the um, current live concert, of course, they will always show off brand new upcoming Macross merchandise that will be coming up. So the big one that they actually showed off was actually the DX Chogokin for um, Maximilian Genesis Durandal. So we've already got information that yes, this Durandal will be coming into production next after uh, Mirage's um, Chaos Valkyrie, the one, brand new one that was actually shown in the new Macross Delta movie. Um, so yeah, that's coming around the corner, and of course, Max Max's Durandal is the next one in production. It seems to be coming with all the additional packs as well, just like we saw with Elto's Durandal recently being released. Um, so yeah, that's pretty exciting. So aside from that, there's actually the other thing, which is kind of spoilerish if you've not seen anything from the Macross Delta movie. Um, so I give you guys a bit of a spoiler warning, uh, if you want to skip ahead, please go ahead and skip ahead. If not, if you are welcome with all the spoilers. Um, there is also one other merchandise that's technically shown off at the event today as well. Uh, so are you guys ready for it? Okay, so we all know that Hayate has a necklace where apparently in the brand new Macross Delta movie, Freya also has one. So yes, P Bandai, yes, sadly to say it's under P Bandai, will be releasing the necklace for Freya Rion that was shown off in the latest Macross Delta movie as well. So yes guys, anyways, all this information I will be uploading up on the Instagram page. Um, you know, thank you for to all the Japanese friends who are currently at the event. And I'll be sharing all the information off Twitter. Um, these photos will not be, you know, um, shown to you guys if I had no connections with all these wonderful people there as well. So thank you to all the Japanese friends. Nihon tomodachi yo, sono sashin no subete wo arigato gozaimashita. Anyways, so thank you guys, all the Japanese friends, for all these wonderful photos sharing of the event that's going on right now for Valkyrie Reborn. Um, so yeah, I'll be updating the rest of the event photos onto the Instagram account um, closer to the end of the day. So guys, let's talk about Kaname's brand new episode play. Um, it seems like Kaname's love is pretty hard to come by nowadays, even in the gacha event that's currently going on at Valkyrie Reborn. So yeah, apparently they kind of showed it off um, during last night's Makutoma where they showed off the 600 yen gacha um, and basically you can do it online but the problem is the prizes can only be collected um, at the event site itself so that's kind of a bummer so international fans we can only go through second hand or 
uh, third party, you know, auctioning and all that kind of stuff. You gotta pay more for all this stuff if you really, really want it. Um, so that's kind of a bummer. Um, so yeah, so when they did the gacha during Makutoma last night, I don't, I don't have a video clip of it now. Um, so sadly to say, I can't show you guys what it was actually done. Um, so basically, Minori, Naobo, and Ken did a 10 item pool um, last night. And it seems like Kanami merchandise was really, really rare to come by. So hopefully, for Kaname fans, Dana decides to bless you guys with some wonderful Kaname love with the current brand new gacha for Kaname. So <laughs> let's take a look at Kaname's episode play and see how it fares um, with the rest of the six star episode plays that has already been released in the past few months. So, yeah. Aside from that, let's talk about this brand new free 10 plate pool gacha for only 2 days, today and tomorrow, the 9th and 10th basically is to celebrate the brand new Valkyrie Reborn live concert that's going on right now. So yes, today and tomorrow, make sure you guys pull this free 10 plate pools, we'll be doing this later as well. But let's talk about Kaname's brand new episode plate first. So coming in at 3,876 total score with its plus 25 luck value. Without the luck, it comes in at 3,626. So if you're wondering how powerful this is, basically it's actually more powerful than Nikumo's episode plate that came in at 3,621. This is without its plus 25 luck value in the last month's uh, last episode plate. So usually the last episode plate of the month would usually be the most powerful episode plate for its rarity. Um, within that month itself. So if Kaname is, is actually more powerful by 5 points, hmm, I wonder why, or rather what the last episode played for this month is going to be like, how powerful it's going to be. Alright, so let's take a look. So Kaname's episode play actually focuses on voice, uh, even though the current event song is technically a rainbow edition song, so you can technically use any colored um, episode plate to try and give you a good high score but with this current event which is the Kuji event you don't really need high score so basically you just need to survive the song play you just need actually healing episode plates to help you out with all the missions and technically that's it <laughs> so second step to get the highest amount of points is soul then of course Chan takes the utter dive down the gutter and of course center skill not like you'll use it, but who knows, maybe it might be your best choice if you don't have any 7 star episode plates in your collection. Center skill unit's voice is boosted by 90% up, which is a fantastic number. Um, let's take a look at the active skill. For 5 seconds, score is boosted by 70% up, so it's the mediocre, modern version of the active skill on all 6 star episode plates recently. So, yeah. Short duration ability, and yes, it is that live skill once again. So, fans of Kaname, Reina, Ranka, and Milane, oh, this episode play is definitely for me. All my three waifus are here. <laughs> so, definitely, I will want to try and attain it. Um, so, yes, as long as your waifus have maxed out affection levels, so yes, if you have it at uh, level 60, right now is the max. You will get that 120% boost in score if you have this as your live skill support. Oh man, there's construction going on again. Okay, so yeah, all the funny noises in my YouTube videos are now a common trend. <laughs> Alright, so moving on to the last page, and it comes with a special note attached to it, and it's a score note. Not like it's very useful for this current event, but you know, for maybe the Diva Improvement event, maybe the following month. Uh, this month we are des definitely going with the high score achieving event. Um, so yeah, this bit will definitely come in handy when it comes to achieve achieving high score. So is this plate actually useful from for fans who are not Kaname fans? Um, yes, it's definitely an episode plate that you definitely want to try and attain, considering that it is with a very useful life skill and it is currently this generation's highest um, amount of points available on the 6 star episode plate and it you know it, live skill wonderful special no attachment to it 
no no doubt about it, it is definitely a must to attain. And it is with a gacha that comes with the use of the event gacha tickets, so that's pretty fantastic as well. So alright, Kanami fans, let's do this. We'll start off with the single daily free pool. Today is the afternoon session. Luckily I managed to rush through the event. Um oh, I forgot to mention about the brand new missions. <laughs> okay, we'll talk about it after we do this single pool. Uh, it's really a break of the norm. This is what happens when you don't when you don't script your videos. <laughs> it's a bit more unexpected. And it kind of makes all you guys watch through the entire thing. <laughs> okay, so speaking of watch through the entire thing, it seems like I think not many people noticed the, the new edited video I did for Sayonara no Tsubasa sung by Walkure because apparently I used the thumbnail with the Durandao there and uh, it seems like, you know, you guys, uh, the the standard kind of public viewing where if you don't see sex appeal in any of the items involved you probably won't click on it so <laughs> yes uh, i'm talking about a brand new edited video i did for sayonara no tsubasa um the well, um the, the culture mixture edition yes even though i use the durando that appears in the original sayonara, sayonara no tsubasa um, live performance with Ranka and Cheryl, you know, I thought I mixed it up a bit because it is the, the culture mixture, so it's nice to include Walkure with Cheryl and Ranka. I was really really proud of that edit and somehow or other it didn't get as many views as the last edited video which was way simpler. Guys, please spread the word for it. It's it's a video I'm very proud of. I hope more of you guys get to enjoy it. Um, I know that videos like this will never get monetized because of copyright reasons, but it will definitely help boost the channel greatly if you guys share the culture around. Um, like I said, I worked really hard on that one and I'm pretty proud of it. So if you guys like it, I know a majority of you do. Um, so just spread the love around. Alright, so let's dive into the mission page first before we move on to the gacha, before I forget again. <laughs> okay, so the brand new missions, as you can tell, Valkyrie Live 2022. We're talking about Valkyrie Reborn, of course. You gotta see the Valkyrie ladies in their cheerleader costume. Technically, they shouldn't be wearing that costume. In fact, they should be doing the ballet costume with all the ribbons. Um, because yeah, it's supposed to be based off that album. Anyways, um, as you can tell, unprofessionally, I've already claimed <laughs> some of my reward gifts. So we'll talk about it from from here. So there are daily missions evolved with this mission list. So make sure you go and clear them. I have a feeling that the songs will change every day. So today is Rune Pika. Uh, I will leave a comment. Uh, in this video down below on what songs you need to play for each day. Uh, if you guys can't read the Japanese titles, oh my goodness, the construction is going on. Oh man. Okay, so do pardon the, the renovation work that's going around my, my my living area that's just horrible. That's when you live in a communica. Um Building, you know, shared by many people, this is what happens and you can't control noise like this. Ah, it, you don't know I've been living with this drilling and all this for the last three days. Today was exceptionally quiet. I thought today they have forgone the construction work, but apparently not. Okay, so Room Pika is today's event, and yes, it just needs you to clear the song once. And of course, there's one that requires you to full combo. I'm trying to speak louder so as to cover the construction noise, but you know. Ah, so full combo, a normal difficulty or harder version of Rune Pika. And yes, you can actually pick Rune Pika to play for the current event. So I'll prove it to you guys in a while. Then of course, they have the regular ones, which is to play a Macross Delta song 5, 10, 15. Let's see, what's the highest amount of number? 30 times. So yes, 30 times of any Macross Delta song, which is perfect for the current event because the event song is a Macross Delta song and of course Rune Pika as suggested is also a Macross Delta song so you can use skip tickets to help you clear this one however 
the one that requires you to full combo, you have to manually play. So the amount of times that you need to manually play to attain full combo, the max is 10 times. The rest is all down here. So you have 1, 2, we've got 5 and 10. So yes, manually play any Macross Delta song 10 times. Technically, if you're playing the current event, this should clear very easily. The missions, however, unlike the live concert, last longer than two days <laughs> so from the 9th to the 25th of april you will get to clear these missions so i wonder how many daily missions there will be so just take note of that and don't forget to claim all these wonderful gifts which is all useful especially since they give super dimension tickets um for you know free to play players this is exceptionally crucial if you want to gain more powerful episode plays for your free play Alright, so let's dive back into the gacha video and try to end this as quickly as I can because the no annoying drilling is still going on. Oh my goodness, what in the world. Ah, and this is why you can't be a YouTuber in a, you know, a non-private estate area. <laughs> I don't have the money to live in more expensive places. Anyway, speaking of which, we will have quite a bit to pull today. So I have 10 tickets to clear from the Super Dimension gacha. So let's do 10 tickets from here. Oh boy. And here it is the weekend. I thought they were not drill, you know, today because people are actually at home trying to rest. Oh my goodness. Inconvenience and inconsiderate neighbors. Oh boy. Okay. Oh no. This is just horrible luck. But it is the Super Dimension Gacha, so. Let's try and attain Karma Maze episode play. That would be beneficial, uh, you know, in the long term. Okay. So all the common stuff seems to be pretty common. Oh, red box. Oh, I don't have this, I think. Oh yeah, it's new for me. Cool. So I apologize that I skipped. Uh, the drilling has made me a bit impatient, so... <laughs> okay. Let's do the... Free template pool for the Walkure live celebration. Let's move all the way up here. So hopefully, I, I know usually the free template pools tend to be horrible. We are able to pull out seven star episode plates from this gacha. But who knows? Like I said, usually these kind of free pools don't end up being fantastic. Oh my goodness, the drilling! I seriously apologize, guys. This was unexpected. The, the early morning, there was no drilling at all. Not sure why I went, when I start recording my videos, then they decide to do this. Okay, nothing fantastic, everything's common blocks. Like I said, all these free template pools uh, usually don't bring anything out, anything nice, but it helps to flush away the bad luck, maybe for the main gacha pools. So let's do this. We are going to the main gacha pool right now. We have the free single pool followed by the event gacha tickets and of course the discounted template pool which we are going to do. So here's a single free pool. Let's see how the luck is for the main gacha. Ooh, low bar. Okay. Okay. So we're not getting any Valkyries for the single free pool. Oh, red box. Wow. Okay, it didn't turn rainbow, but red box in the single free pool. Okay, you get a tomato boy singing his song. Alright, so it is something we do have quite a bit already, but still in the single digits, that's fantastic. So it seems like the luck is kind of there for the main banner. Hopefully we get Kaname's brand new episode plate. Yes, if you're wondering, the costume is locked behind this gacha wall, so that's kind of a bummer. So let's go with the event gacha tickets right now. Oh my goodness, I guess the rest of this video you're gonna hear all the drilling noises. Oh, that was a low bar. Pretty decent speed. Okay, go. Great box on the first bling. Oh boy. Okay, so it seems like the 10 plates from the event gacha ticket end up being unfruitful. Oh well. Okay. 
is the neighbor's drilling actually causing me bad luck? What's on my main love though? Oh, costume points! That's the bare minimum! No evolution on the red plate. That's fine. Do I have this? No, apparently it's new! Wow. Okay, so the bare minimum has been met. I am fantastic with this. Um, even if I don't get the plate today, you know, eventually in the future it might come around. I just gotta be patient. So yeah. Okay, so let's do this, the final pool, template pool with the discounted 300 singing stones. Hopefully we get something, maybe additional costume points. You know, it'll be good if I can spend less on the episode ops. Hmm. Alright, there we go. One, two, three. No, four, five. Okay, so mediocre luck. Oh no, no red boxes. Oh boy. Okay, so no luck at all for Kaname. I told you guys, it seems like, you know, Kaname friends are having some hard times. It's not just Utam across. Look at the Valkyrie Reborn life. Ooh, more custom points. Fantastic. Um, even Kaname goods are pretty hard to come by. So that's kind of a problem for all the Kaname fans. Oh, I skipped all the red boxes today. I'm sorry guys, I just got very patient because it's, it's just not been going well today. <laughs> anyway guys, that's it for today. What do you guys think of all the information I shared today? If you like Macross information like what I share with, about the Durando, Freya's necklace, you know, that kind of stuff. If you want me to do it as a separate video, that kind of thing where we just purely talk about Macross as such from Utah Macross, let me know in the comment section down below or even on Instagram. Um, what do you guys think about Kanami's episode plate? Is it definitely a plate that you really, really need or want to get? Um, or did you even actually get it in your own personal pools? Let me know all your thoughts in the comment section down below as always. And of course, guys, make sure you check out the brand new edited um, video for Sayonara no Tsubasa, the culture mixture edition. Um, yeah, and spread the culture around with all your Macross loving friends. And until then, guys, thank you guys so much as always if you watch through the entire thing. I love you guys a whole bunch. And of course, until see you guys in the next video, hopefully with less drilling involved. Bye! <laughs>